The Sad Life of Ron Howard. Ron Howard was born on March 1, 1954 age 66. Dot was born in Duncan, Oklahoma 1954, the elder son of Jean Spiegel Howard, an actress, and Rance Howard, a director, writer, and actor. His father was born with the surname Beckenholt and took the stage name Howard in 1948 for his acting career. Rance Howard was serving three years in the United States Air Force at the time of Ron's birth. The family moved to Hollywood in 1958, the year before the birth of his younger brother Clint Howard. They rented a house on the block south of the Desilu Studios, where The Andy Griffith Show was later filmed. They lived in Hollywood for at least three years, before moving to Burbank. Howard was tutored at Desilu Studios in his younger years but continued his schooling at Robert Louis Stevenson Elementary and David Starr Jordan Jr. High when not working in television, eventually graduating from John Burroughs High School. He later attended the University of Southern California's School of Cinematic Arts but did not graduate. Howard has said he knew from a young age he might want to go into directing, thanks to his early experience as an actor is an American film director, producer, and actor. Howard first came to prominence as a child actor, guest starring in several television series, including an episode of The Twilight Zone. He gained national attention for playing young Opie Taylor, the son of Sheriff Andy Taylor played by Andy Griffith in the sitcom The Andy Griffith Show from 1960 through 1968. During this time, he also appeared in the musical film The Music Man, a critical and commercial success. He was credited as Ronnie Howard in his film and television appearances from 1959 to 1973. Howard was cast in one of the lead roles in the coming-of-age film American Graffiti and became a household name for playing Richie Cunningham in the sitcom Happy Days, a role he would play from 1974 through 1980. In 1980, Howard left Happy Days to focus on directing, producing, and occasionally writing variety films and television series. His films included the comedies Night Shift, Splash, and Cocoon as well as the fantasy Willow, the thriller Backdraft, and the newspaper comedy drama film The Paper. In 1995, Howard gained widespread praise and recognition in the historical docudrama Apollo 13 in 1995. Howard continued directing such films as the biographical drama A Beautiful Mind, the biographical sports drama Cinderella Man, the historical drama Frost Nixon, the biographical sports drama Rush, and the historical adventure film In the Heart of the Sea. Howard is also known for directing the children's fantasy film How the Grinch Stole Christmas as well as the Robert Langdon film series, The Da Vinci Code, Angels and Demons, and Inferno. Howard also directed Solo, A Star Wars Story and the documentary films, The Beatles, Eight Days a Week, and Pavarotti. Howard received the Academy Award for Best Director and Academy Award for Best Picture for A Beautiful Mind and was nominated again for the same awards for Frost Nixon. In 2003, Howard was awarded the National Medal of Arts. He was inducted into the Television Hall of Fame in 2013. Howard has two stars on the Hollywood Walk of Fame for his contributions in the television and motion pictures industries. Through ups and downs along with those things, his relatives gradually lost. The fact that he could not show his parents' filial piety was a great loss. <laughs>